Hello viewers, welcome back. So today we continue with series of animated videos. So this time I present you Christopher Gibson. You remember it from the past and you can check my first video, how it was designed and how it's supposed to work. But today I will show how it rotates and how it really in one moment, why this motor is the best example how magnetic shielding can be used in magnetic motors that they can operate. So let's get to the drawings. All right, so now this is the set. It's really simple. Basically, you see that there is a stator and there is a rotor. And between the stator and the rotor are, of course, these moon metal plates. These sheets on the edge of the rotor and the edge of the stator, these round sheets represent the moon metal shielding. And of course, we would have a moon metal plate on the top of the stator, but it's not shown here. All right, from this corner, you see that the, in one moment, uh, two magnets will repel one from the other and the other three will not. Yeah? So this is not seen from this corner, but you will now see from the top. Okay, so now this is the top view when you see that the system is spinning. And when I stop this at uh, one point, for example, at this point, you see that only two magnets on the bottom uh, right corner will repel each other because other three sets would not have the opportunity because they are far one from the other on the circle. And if we are, for example, uh, seeing the um, right top magnet, so in the right top corner, they are very close. And uh, if there is no moon metal here, for example, we will have a problem because uh, this would stop the system because the other uh, poles would uh, attract and stop the system. And this is basically it. Thank you for watching viewers. Until next video, please stay tuned on my channel for more free energy videos.